Okay, so how do you link to article pages and Squiddly pages and YouTube videos? Well, I'm in cPanel here for prplunder.com and if I go down to here where it says domains, you can see subdomains. I'll click on that. I've got one set up already and all I'm going to do is make a new subdomain. Um, now this, this can be um, restricted by whoever has your hosting. If you've got a reseller account then you can set this to unlimited. Um, if, if you're with someone else, sometimes you set a limit of 5 or 10. Um, you, you should be able to find that out on um, on your hosting package or you can ask their support. So I'm going to put in a new subdomain here, so new to, and then the document root, that's basically where the files are because you can actually build a, an entire new website on the subdomain if you wanted to. Um, you have to put something here, so I'll just leave it at the default. Okay, that's being created. If I go back, and you can see here new2.plplunder.com has no redirections. So if I click here, it says manage redirection. And now I can send it to there. Press save. Okay, and you can't see this, but what I'm going to do here is um, navigate to that URL. So new2.plplunder.com click on that and it takes me to the home page so that's how the redirection works so if I go back you can put in a YouTube video here instead or an article directory so but by, by doing like this it doesn't have to go to to your actual website like I've said it to, to my website home page but if you set this to a YouTube video or an art, article directory then that means that if you use that subdomain in PR Plunder in your CSV file, that means you're actually building link juice and building PR to the page that you set here. Alright? It's as simple as that. Thanks.